Praise the Lord, my dear brothers and sisters. Very good morning to you in the name of our Lord God and Saviour King, Jesus Christ. Once again, welcome to Good Morning Jesus. Give us this day our daily bread. My dear brothers and sisters, in today's word of God from the book of Matthew, chapter 7, verse 7, the Bible tells us that ask and it will be given to you. What a beautiful word of God. Ask and it will be given to you. So, it involves a lot of faith and it also involves a lot of confidence when it comes to asking God. And uh, when this word of God is given to us by God, it's like telling us that ask and it will be given to you. So when you go to God, when you go to the Lord and when we go to the Lord, when we ask God, we've got to go with a real strong faith and a confidence that tells us that God will give it to us. And that confidence comes to us through His Word. Because many a times you see when we have some simple fights at home or justification to be done, you know what we do is that we try to catch hold of that person by that what he spoke or she spoke. And then we tell her, did you not speak that? Did you not tell that? Did you not tell so and so thing? Did you not speak this word? Uh, so and so thing. You catch by the word. And sometimes nowadays things have become more uh, electronic and all those things. So people even have a recording with them and they tell them, see, that day when you spoke to me, you said so and so thing. And then they said that person maybe says, no, I never said a word like that. And then somebody tries to point out from the mobile, see, I already have a recording that tells tells you, basically, a recording that tells what you really spoke and has got a very tangible proof with him or with her. So, these sort of proofs that is there uh, basically puts the other person in a fix and then that person has got to like uh, agree to what he spoke or she spoke and then abides by it. But here, God himself is reminding us and telling us that uh, ask and it will be given to you. It's like telling us, now I myself have told you that uh, uh, you can ask me, you should ask me and uh, you will receive that what you ask. And on top of that, God himself is giving us a reminder, telling us that in Matthew 7, 7, you know, I have told you that and yet why are you so silent about it? Why are you not talking about it? Why are you not reminding me? Why are you not coming to me? You know? You, you, when it comes to asking, you've gone all around the world asking for favor, asking for help, asking for different things. And there are times when you have received and you have not received also. And uh, yet why do you not come to me? I've told you very clearly, come to me, ask me and I will give you. So today, my dear brothers and sisters, in this month of Jan, there could be a lot of requirements and commitments to be taken care of. Like, um, there could be so many things with regards to payments because, uh, you see, the income tax payment maybe have to be done by this month, within this month, or there's certain other business payments or house rent, uh, electricity payments. This I'm speaking of the financial aspect. Or maybe somebody is praying for somebody's good health or for a healing, okay? There are lots of somebody is praying for a career, for a good job, for a promotion, for an appraisal. There are lots of these good things, lots of these things that we need to ask God. And God said, and God says, it will be given to you. So today, this morning, take this as a promised word of God, okay? As I mentioned to you, when somebody needs to catch somebody by that what she has spoken, he spoke, speaks, we take the proof, we take a mobile recording or we take a witness with us and tell that this is what you spoke, come on, abide by it. But as in our case, God Himself is telling us and reminding us, this is what I have spoken. So, I am ready to abide by that, provided you come to me and ask for it, it will be done. So amazing, so beautiful. That's the difference between God and us. Hmm? So today, this morning, let's ask God, for that what we need, that what we want. And surely for sure, God will bless us. Can we pray? Come on. Father God in heaven, we praise and we thank you. 
we worship you we adore you we glorify and exalt your holy name on high you alone are worthy of all praise and honor you are a god you are a king and a savior today we come to you father to give us the grace to ask you that what we need there are so many requirements there are financial requirements there are uh, there is healing needed then there is requirements for careers good job good appraisal or life partner the gift of a child so uh, good house good vehicle lots of things that we need in our life and we're longing for and you are reminding us through your own word that we need to ask you and you will be giving it to us today we come to you with all our intentions and petitions to you father let it all be done according to your riches and glory let grace be made available to us and complete in our life just the way you want and not the way we want in jesus name we pray amen 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 my dear brothers and sisters today keep this word of god deep down in your heart and just abide by this word of god pray in the name of jesus using this word of god and surely for sure before sunset today you would have seen that all your prayers have been answered stay blessed be blessed till we meet again goodbye and god bless you